Arizona, 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 Arizona. Arizona, 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 Arizona. The Arizona, number seven Arizona, selection Arizona. in the 2017 NHL draft belongs to the Arizona Coyotes. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Arizona slides back three oh positions. God. That translates into New Jersey being picked. In a trend in 2017, a big movement, New Jersey, has vaulted into the top three. The first overall selection, the 2017 NHL draft, belongs to the New Jersey Devils. Yeah! Yes! The New Jersey Devils have won the 2017 NHL draft lottery. <laughs> Let's go! They will pick first overall for the first time since 1979. It happens really quick, and last year, um, I think we were 12th going in, and we never moved, so it was really quick. Next thing you know, Philadelphia moves up, and after that, they move up, they say they'll be picking in the top three. And my first thought, I was on stage thinking, you gotta be kidding me. Philadelphia just got what? And what? And then I'm thinking, where does that leave us? Are we gonna be like eight for sure? Or, uh, I've won already, I'm, I'm just happy to be here. And I'm not that great at math, but I'm figuring we might have a decent chance here to win the lottery. Is I think it's an exciting day for our franchise, for our ownership, for our fans, for the people that work here. That, you know what, I think there's really kind of shows a light at the end of the tunnel a bit. Hopefully that's a sign of good luck. Winning a lottery, striking it rich, or finding a four-leaf clover. All are instances of a worldly phenomenon, luck. If you are a Devils fan, you might not have felt as lucky lately, but luck has changed. In winning the NHL's draft lottery, a young Devils team has a chance to make a shift with a game-changing player coming to the Garden State. While the scouting process is a year-round operation, it culminated in late May at the NHL Combine in Buffalo, New York for the first moments of a face-to-face. -face. Most of those kids have been interviewed by us. Anything in this game, whether it's scouting, analytics, uh, all the interviews, the testing, uh, Amy's work, it's, you know, it's all information. I think it's all part of trying to minimize errors, mistakes, and give you just all, all the information you could hope for and trying to then make a decision. Like, you're not going to draft a player because of an interview or not draft them, probably. It's just another part of information to try to give you everything you need to make that decision. As we see in the playoffs, there's so many important players and pieces to, to winning. Is could be a third-round pick, seventh-round pick, a free agent. Hopefully, you know, our homework's going to pay off. The question getting asked across hockey and debated across the Garden State who will the Devils take with the coveted first pick at the NHL draft? Power center Nolan Patrick? You know, when we were trending the last two, three months, I mean, I said to Paul Cashman, I said, Paul, like, you better be ready. Like, we might get a real good pick or we're not really expecting. And I wasn't expecting one. Um, but it's been one of those things. And, you know, you've heard about Nolan Patrick. And, and the year before, certainly for us, has been beneficial because even though they played 30-some games this year and not all of them healthy, he had a really great body of work the year before and even a year before that uh, with Brandon. And um, so we've known a lot about Nolan Patrick. The other consensus top choice is a dynamic forward from Switzerland, Nico Heeshear. Heeshear has been really interesting because he comes from Switzerland. And, but I think for him to come over and play in Halifax was really beneficial for him. The impact he had on that team, a younger team, to make the playoffs, uh, that's a team that's had some good success winning the World Cup. But he was really the reason they got there. They're two different type of players. It's a question that even Ray Shiro cannot answer until the evening of June 23rd in Chicago. But that doesn't stop everyone from making their case from water coolers in Newark to bar stools in Jersey City. This is the question the GM Ray Shiro and the Devils team of coaches and scouts is working to answer. It really starts with what the criteria is. And our scouts here know what our criteria is. And there'll be some players that are not on our list that will go maybe in the first round. These guys got two days that they work all year for on Friday and Saturday in Chacago. So um, it's exciting for them and a little nerve wracking as well. So not even just me, but I'd assume the scouts are a little bit nervous and uh, not just for New Jersey, but for other teams as well. So 
uh, but it's an exciting time. To appreciate where we find ourselves, we truly have to start with the moment where our luck changed. So much goes into the decision that can change the fortune of a team, but doesn't change the preparation. Because after all, the best luck is the luck that you make yourself. Well, you always want some good fortune and some luck, but uh, there is something to be said about making your own luck, and that's preparation, that's hard work, uh, all the things that go into making yourself lucky. <laughs> but I'm a big believer, uh, for the most part, you make your own luck. There's a ghost kind of fast. 49 flight 2001, service to Chicago. Our flight time today will be one hour and 55 minutes over to Chicago. For three-time Devils Stanley Cup champion Ken Danico, luck is about what you put into it. For Ray Shiro's team of scouts, the time has come as the team is on the clock as they arrive in Chicago to select the number one pick in Friday night's draft. I'm not going to say I've made my mind up. Some agents might ask, hey, are you going to take my guy? And I've, I've said, to, you know, the guys that are rated the top what, I've said to them, I said, no, I'm not going to tell you. I'm not set up another meeting with anybody next week in Chicago. Not sure I need one. Countless factors calculated, and the question on everyone's mind who will it be? Nico or Nolan? But the fortune bestowed on the team winning the draft lottery wasn't expected to be so gratuitous. First off, I'm pumped. I mean, this is so exciting for Devils fans. I, I, we're fortunate in the lottery, and, and luck was on our side. You know, it's not every day that you get the number one overall pick. and It's going to be an exciting time coming up shortly, but uh, there's no question we're going to get an impact player and a guy that not only from now, but you, look, you have to look for the future three, four years down the road, road and project what is he going to be. A number one draft choice has created options that were unexpected shifting possibilities Ray Shiro must contemplate. I think with anything as I, you know, from moving from five to one, it, it does give us more options because we're at five, we're not getting one of these two players we're talking about, and I'm not getting the calls I'm getting now at five that I'm at at one. You know, we have uh, some good assets, uh, you know, moving forward and taking advantage of them is the most important thing. As the hours count down, the anticipation grows. With the stage being set, the lights on, the cameras rolling, and millions following the conversation, whose name will be called? What will it change for Devils fans? What will it bring to a young roster in the pursuit to be faster, stronger, and together? It's yet another time where we all watch Devils history be made. It wasn't really on purpose uh, to get the first overall pick. Well, in hockey, I think the, the new word for luck is randomness. And I think the way the game is played, there's a lot of random things that go on. Yeah, there's luck. And again, I'm not sure if you make your own luck. We didn't try that hard to do that. But I think it's one of those things, you know, it's part of life and the game. And, um, you know, hopefully take advantage of it. The first selection of the 2017 NHL Draft belongs to the New Jersey Devils. It's exciting. It's, it's, it's so to, to know that, you know, after a few years in the wilderness, we're, we're finally going to get, you know, overnight a guy who can contribute at a high level and, and, you know, make us better. With our first election and at the 2017 draft, the New Jersey Devils are proud to welcome from the Halifax Mooseheads, Nico Heischer. Heischer has just become the first Swiss-born player to go number one overall in the NHL draft. Nico, 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 Nico. Nico, congratulations. 
What are the thoughts going through your mind right now as you become the number one overall pick and you're wearing the New Jersey Devils uniform? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm speechless. I mean, uh, I don't know what to say. Uh, it's just an incredible feeling. You, you can't describe it. Overall, I'm, I'm ecstatic. I think it went really good, and I'm glad that they picked Nico. Nico, try the Taylor Ham, number one. And number two, leave it all out on the ice, and Jersey fans are going to love you. Welcome to New Jersey, Nico. <laughs> With the Devils choosing Nico Heischer, they've chosen a fast, dynamic forward who will bring much-needed scoring to the Devils roster. You know, Nico's got that you know great playmaking ability, is an ability to make other players better. And you know, for our franchise, we thought that was the best pick, and uh, so it was a good day for us. I didn't want me to focus on one team. I was open for everything, but I'm so glad right now to, to wear this jersey and to be part of this organization. After a whirlwind moment from media, a few photo opportunities, and some autographs for new fans of the number one pick, Nico Heeshear finally finds a moment with his family. With the long night's roller coaster of activities of media interviews and photo ops, the time has come for the number one pick to call it a day. With the journey to one soon coming to a close, Nico Heeshear brings high hopes for a team eager to place luck in their own hands and begin their next odyssey towards their return to greatness.